Doctors are learning more and more about a condition that could threaten the lives of unborn identical twins. It's called twin to twin transfusion syndrome. As our health reporter Haley Hernandez shows us here, it must be caught quickly for the children to survive. Dr. Kenneth Moise at Children's Memorial Hermann Hospital says twins, especially identical twins, are on the rise with an increase in use of in vitro fertilization, and identical twins face a risk of not surviving the pregnancy. When they share that placenta, they share blood vessels across between them. They get out of balance, if you would. Their circulations get out of balance. About 15% of identical twins share the same placenta and get uneven blood flow from the mother. One child too little, the other too much. If it's not caught, they won't survive. Moise performs this delicate surgery to reverse the deadly complication. We put a very tiny telescope into the sac of the larger twin, actually, and we use a laser beam, if you would, to spot well the bad vessels and separate the placenta into two separate circulations. So the blood flow stops between the babies. Kimberly Rivera was carrying Olivia and Layla when symptoms of twin to twin transfusion came on last year in her second trimester. I became really large quickly. My uterus grew. I had a lot of abdominal discomfort, a lot of swelling, and I honestly thought that was just because I was carrying twins. And when I look back at twin to twin transfusion symptoms, those actually match my symptoms to a T. And had I known that, I probably would have been a little prepared for the diagnosis of twin to twin transfusion. Dr. Moise told her that pain, swelling, and discomfort were signs the babies needed this fetal surgery. The promising news is that in 80 to 90 percent of cases, both babies survive. If we don't do the surgery, 90 percent of the time we lose the whole pregnancy. I could imagine it. You know, as I said, I'm an identical twin and I went through life with my twin, and so just to have to only have one of them would have been really heartbreaking for us. The real take home message is for expectant mothers of identical twins to make sure your doctor is carefully watching for twin to twin transfusion. Dr. Moise says ultrasounds are recommended as frequently as every two weeks. Haley Hernandez, KPRC, Channel 2 News.